arithmetic means adding numbers Crypt arithmetic means using this 10 different digit replacing this English alphabet we are going to follow some rules to get this let plus li equal all that means when you are adding 3 digit number with another 3 digit number we are getting a different 3 digit number we have to follow our own rules the rules are rule number 1 we should not use two different numbers for the same letter like that we should not use same number for two different letter one more rule the very important rule is maximum carry over is one these three rules we have to keep in mind apply the rule when you are solving this type of problem but usually problems like uh, send plus more equals money zero plus point equals uh, energy we will write number one then we will start in this problem we cannot write because this two number adding will get any digit but it will get only single digit if you see send plus more equals money or zero plus point equals energy that type of problem you will get one more uh, column so we we'll start from one please watch that video easily you can understand why we started from one but here we cannot start from one it may zero one two three four five six or whatever number but adding number itself we are getting a single digit number for example we cannot write l equal to 5 if you are writing l equal to 5 you will get 5 plus 5 10 here we should not write 10 if some uh, column is there or some alphabet is there we can write 10 carry over 1 that is the carry over right here 1 so l maximum can get value 4 so we can assign maximum value 4 for l that means 0 to 4 so we cannot assign l equal to 5 and above so we will check one by one so we are going to check for 0 so if write l equal to 0 0 plus 0 will get 0 that is without carry over this column is carry over now this is like a trial and error method now we are going to check for 0 to 4 so as I told you l can have the value for L equal to 0, 1 to 4. That means L can be 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4 only. So L we cannot assign 5 and above. We will check 1 by 1. When L equal to 0 without carry over. Carry over means writing this. That means here one number, here another number, different number adding. If you are getting a two digit number, you write a carry over 1. The carry over always 1. That means adding these two numbers, you will not get more than 19. Maximum you will get 19 number 9 will write here the remaining one that is carry over so when you are writing L equal to 0 without carry over 0 plus 0 will get 0 so this is not possible you should not write this condition is not satisfying the rule that means you will get L and A same number now we will check with carry over if you are writing L equal to 0 with carry over that means 0 plus 0 here 1 A will get 1 so it is satisfying the condition satisfying the rule but you have to check for another column also for this column when l equal to 0 with carry over l equal to 0 without carry over is not possible so we strike out now l equal to 0 with carry over here 1 here 1 will get l equal to 0 and 1 now l equal to 0 how to get l equal to 0 a number added to itself will get getting 0 see here 0 0 carry over 1, 1, this is like trial and error method so I am not writing in the middle of the box corner I am writing if this condition satisfies this both this like a 3 column also we can choose that number so L equal to 0 without carry over is not possible now I am checking for L equal to 0 with carry over so 0, 0, 1 added 1 if I am getting carry over 1 means the previous column has a 2 digit number so here you must get a 2 digit number either like a 12, 13, 14, 15, whatever number so to get here 0 so you have to get a 10 only because already we have you may assume that l equal to 0 so getting 10 only one possibility that is 5 plus 5 there is no other possibilities so 5 plus 5 we are getting 10 so you can write there is no carry over so previous column is a single digit number here 0 so a number added to another number we are getting 0 that means 5 added to 5 only will get 0 so we cannot uh, assign again t equal to 5 so l equal to 0 with carry over also is not possible so listen carefully l equal to 0 without carry over and l equal to 0 with carry over is not possible because 
in this column the rule is not satisfying that means to get here 10 or 0 here you have to write 5 the same number 5 so 5 is added with 5 only you are getting ending with 0 so I, I cannot uh, assign t equal to 5 so next number l equal to 1 we will check for l equal to 1 so anyway we are going to get here single digit only when l equal to 1 here, uh, here also like this one here 1 so 1 plus 1 2 the same one you write here here 2 without carry over means in the place of a you will write 2 with carry over means 1 plus 1 plus 1 3 you will write that will check now here 1 here 1 so a number added to itself we are ending with 1 that is 11 we are ending with 1 if it is carry over means it is 11 without carry over means 1 but without carry over there is no not possible to get 1 because 0 plus 1 only 1 or you can write here 0 and 0 with the carry over 1 you can write 1 now we will check for this trial and error method writing 5 5 5 plus 5 10 here you should get 1 11 that means here you start the carry over previous column is a 2 digit number here also uh, so 1 11 e equal to 5 so 5 added to 6 only you get 11 so here one more thing you have to keep in mind this column starting with carry over is not possible because there is no previous column so we can cancel this is like a trial and error method now check for l equal to 1 with the carry over 5 plus 5 10 plus 1 11 the carry over 1 here 1 plus 1 plus 1 3 so I think the answer for this question is 156 plus 155 added will get 311 this is L equal to 1 without carry over is not possible L equal to 1 with carry over is possible that means you no need to check for the value L equal to 2, 3, 4 with carry over without carry over because when L equal to 1 with carry over this 3 columns satisfy the rule the rules means same number for the same letter same number for the same letter different number for the different letter so the answer for this question is 156 added to 155 equal to 311 thank you for watching thank you